Fallout, a game of moral ambiguity, a game that allows you to choose your path. One of the fun things about Fallout, I remember it blew my mind the first time I played the original Fallout, and I figured out that some kids got in the way of, of a gunfight, mm-hmm. and I might have just out of curiosity targeted them, maybe not. I discovered <laughs> wow. that I could just gun down children in the first game, which is, by the way, not something I recommend anyone do in, in real life or even video games, but they allowed you to in the first Fallout. They've, they've changed that since. Um, but I was like, wow, they really, there's are no limits on what I can do here uh, morally. Now, there were severe consequences for that, uh, for those actions, uh, which I appreciated. But Fallout allows you to play a lot of different ways. How do you guys plan to play Fallout. Does it pay to be a good guy in Fallout? I don't think so. I remember like everything good about my first playthrough as a bad guy in Fallout 3 was because I was bad. Like <laughs> I was richer, <laughs> I had more resources, I could just take what I wanted without any like without a second thought. I had a way nicer apartment because I decided to destroy an entire town by detonating a <laughs> nuclear bomb. Uh it was awesome. So you and were I mean, a Megaton killer then. You, you oh took yeah. out Megaton. Yeah. Well, yeah, I had that brief moment where I was like, I'm going to be killing all of these people. And then I was like, all those guys, all of those people are idiots anyway. Like, <laughs> they live wow. in a hole. Like, we would be better off without them. So you're pure Rick Grimes in Alexandria. You're yeah. Just, I mean, okay. anything for the cause, man. Like, that's the thing is, I live in a wasteland. Like, <laughs> the world is not this nice, like, black and white, like, you can be good or evil. It's we like, you kind of... can make it better. Yeah, and that's the thing is like my first my first playthrough in Fallout 3, I was like I'm going to do everything terribly, but I was kind of there was this opposition because I also wanted to help my father achieve his goal with the water, which and it's like hard to resist because he's Liam Neeson and he's so charming and I'm just like, "Yes, father, I want to help you." Also, at the same time, I'm going to kill all of these people. It was just like a little bit contradictory, but no, I mean, I because I try so hard to be a good person in real life, video games are like my outlet for being a total jerk. And so that is what I like to do in these games, and that is how I'm going to play it, at least quick, the first time. Quick aside there, there's nothing worse than having a disappointed Liam Neeson dad. Oh, yeah. See, that's the thing. <laughs> is like, like, I'm so disappointed in you, so I'm like, no, Liam Neeson! No, Liam Neeson! Who would, who would be the worst me? dad to be disappointed by? Like, I mean, and Liam like, Neeson's I, close to the top yeah, of the yeah. list, right? I don't know. I think like if, if like John Malkovich just looked at you like Also Han Solo. Uh, like, no, he's always cool. Angry and and be like, oh, geez. <laughs> uh, up. Yeah. Maybe like I don't know. You, oh, you 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 threw me off. I, I had know. an idea there. If oh, Bruce sorry. Willis was disappointed in me, I'd be really oh. sad. I'd be a really sad lady. Mm. You just look at you like I'm Michael Caine would be a hard man to Ooh, disappoint. Oh yeah, that would be difficult. Yeah. Just yeah. have him like just like just start crying from like the dark night. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. And, and then we, it's, oh. suddenly he goes all Michael Caine and like get Carter and just like rip your eyeballs out. <laughs> We know next to nothing about this game, you know, on account of it not being out yet. But yeah. are we past the point where a Liam Neeson or a Michael Caine can appear as a main character in a video game like this? They Just do. Have, there's always, I've, and there's been a kind of a uh, not all games, but a lot of them had that surprise cameo, like you know, Sean Bean was in, in Oblivion, mm-hmm. and they had um, Liam, uh, Liam Neeson, and I think there was somebody else in one of the other games, and it was like they weren't expressly like. Uh, Patrick Stewart also was the yeah, king in right. Oblivion. Just like they, uh, they aren't always like you know advertised. It's not like one of the, like those big like uh, Beyond Two Souls where it's like William Defoe and Ellen mm-hmm. Page is themselves. It's like no, it's just kind of like they're they're in there, but they they're not the the main focus of the game. Yeah. yeah. So I would like to see someone like really cool just come in. I think Hawking would be awesome. Just just running it, even if he's playing Stephen a Stephen Hawking. Yeah, Stephen Hawking. I think he'd be an amazing cameo in, in a Fallout game. Like if you just ran into some dude that that has a, <laughs> whether it be a computer or a, a, a synthetic of some kind that speaks that way, I think it'd be awesome if you played. Or he's uh, now well. attached to like a monster truck. Yeah. <laughs> like he's well, there is he's like now a it warlord. Is my time yeah. to rule. Yeah. <laughs> Speaking of morality. Uh, <laughs> back so, back so, to your morality thing. I'll but take who, I think the big part is like who blew up Megaton? That's that's a big point uh, of morality there. Like it's I, did I, it. I didn't I didn't do it until I was done with everything else. See, I made a mistake. You cannot collect all of the bobbleheads because or I couldn't collect all of the bobbleheads because I blew up Megaton uh-huh. not knowing that there was uh-huh. a bobblehead there. That's why. <laughs> and so I was always short one bobblehead. That See, was your penalty for murdering yeah. thousands. My yep. style was jerk ass thief okay. who didn't obviously kill everybody. But I didn't help everybody either. Mm. So I wanted to get the most out of doing all the quests mm-hmm. and getting rewards. But if that also meant that I would just go in their house later and steal everything, that was fine with me. So you were like narcissistic. Yeah. yeah if it, I was in it for the personal gain. 
pragmatic narcissistic. Yeah, didn't always kill people, but I did take my share. You were like See, a Malcolm Reynolds slash Han Solo <laughs> character. Not a murderer, but not a great guy. Yeah, I like that Malcolm Reynolds. So I you're Mal moments. Reynolds. You're like Lord Humongous in hockey armor and spikes. Uh, what about what about you, Miranda? So first time through, I was an angel, of course. No, mm-hmm. but yeah, I do the good playthrough. I mean, you want to help people? They just they're just trying to live. They're trying to live like you. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah, and they're impeding too. on if my you, ability to do them, so. They can help you, and you can get all the bobbleheads. <laughs> so, you know, it pays pays yeah. to be good sometimes. You get extra um, bobblehead if you're good. Yeah, but it's like heaven. But then I started another save, and I blew up Megaton. So yeah. <laughs> just to see what would happen. Or? Yeah, and I wanted okay. a nice apartment. So, you know, but it really is a nice apartment. <laughs> okay, so so good evil self-absorbed sure. which is possibly the root of all evil i mean yep. really i'm coming down to it yeah i'm a good guy i'm nice uh i i just we would have I'm, never guessed yeah, so yeah. i would love to see point. jared being a jerk to someone <laughs> even in a i game. was about to say the same thing about miranda it's hard for me to imagine her doing the terrible things oh I no i've seen her laughing maniacally when she's like, playing games i don't know i, <laughs> I curse a lot with shooters so yeah she <laughs> I does get really violent yeah I, I i share a share a desk with miranda and i just hear over the other side because i can't see over the little wall then just profanities just come arcing <laughs> over the top of it a few times a day <laughs> yeah, so it, it happens just you gotta make me mad enough mm. yeah so yeah. all together uh what about you guys uh, anybody listening uh let us know uh where uh, you can tweet at vault underscore ign or at any one of our twitters let us know uh your morality uh good guy or bad guy in fallout we'd love to find out 